Hello viewers, welcome to Geology. My name is Jitesh and in this video I want to share with you a simple trick to get Android 10's navigational gestures in OnePlus 5. Since OnePlus 5 came with hardware buttons, OnePlus didn't include the gestures in its latest OS update for this. But since it is Android 10, the navigational gestures lie underneath the skin, which can be brought out with this simple trick. Also you don't need to install any third party apps for this to work. Although you have to note that this trick will work only in phones that's running Android 10 operating system. So in this case for the OnePlus 5 that's running OS 10.0 or above or the Android 10 beta versions. Doing this is really easy. All you need are a compatible phone, a PC with ADB drivers installed and a USB charging cable to connect them. The link to the ADB drivers are mentioned in the description below. Please download it before continuing. To install the ADB drivers, download the installer from the given link. Open it and when asked, press Y to say yes. After the installation, go to C drive and you will find a folder named ADB with files like this inside. Now go to the phone and enable the on-screen buttons inside the settings. Then go inside your phone's developer options. Scroll down until you see the USB debugging and turn it on. If you don't have the developer options enabled, then go to the about phone first, then tap on the build number 7 times continuously until it tells you that you are a developer. Now go back to settings. Go to system and you will find the developer options at the bottom. After enabling the USB debugging there, connect your phone to your PC with the USB cable. Now in PC, go to the ADB folder inside the C drive. Then right click on the empty space inside the folder while holding the shift key pressed on the keyboard. In the menu, you will find an option to open the Windows PowerShell or the command prompt here depending on the Windows version you are using. Either of them will work the exact same way here. Alternatively, you can click on the address bar and type cmd there, which too will open up the command prompt. In the command prompt window, type this command and hit enter. Your phone will ask for permission now, which you have to allow. Your device's ADB ID will be displayed on screen and then you can continue. Now type the next command. and hit enter again. Now check your phone and you will see the gestures replacing your on screen buttons. This is Android 10's native gestures and it won't create any glitches and will perform smoothly. You can swipe up from the bottom to go home, swipe in from the edges to go back and swipe diagonally from the bottom to activate the voice assistant. The only downside is that you won't be able to go to settings to customize the gestures as the settings will show as if the phone is still using the 3 button navigation. Also, you won't be able to use the on-screen buttons now as it's replaced by the gestures. In case if you don't like the navigational gestures and go back to the three buttons like before, all you need to do is connect the phone with the USB debugging enabled and the command prompt opened like I said earlier. Make sure the phone is connected with ADB devices command. Then run this command. and your phone will be back to how it was. That's that about it. Hope you found this video helpful and informative. I need your help in running the channel, so if you have found this video interesting and helpful, please click on the like button. And if you would like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to this channel and hit on the bell icon too to get notified when I post a video. If you have any suggestions or questions, please leave them in the comment section below as well. I thank you for watching and hope you have a great day. Take care, wear a mask, maintain social distance and stay safe.